people ask me why I parked my Jeep in the garage overnight. Well, we got 60 mile an hour winds, hail, crazy storm passing through tonight. Can't really see it with this camera. And the hail was heavier before I got here, but I can see out there right now half dollar size pieces. The Crazy Picker Life with Wheeler, Dealer, and Banana Peeler. Good morning, fellow pickers and would be adventurers. This is Dealer with the Crazy Picker Life. It is Friday morning, and it's just after 6 a.m. I've got uh, yesterday's episode edited this morning and out on time, and that feels kind of good. Today's episode is unknown, <laughs> so I don't know what I'm filming yet, but uh, it will be live tomorrow. That'll be exciting. It'll be live Saturday morning. So I'm preparing for this trip to Wisconsin. I'm taking Wheeler and Banana Peeler and we're heading out for a week. In Wisconsin is my hometown where I spent a good share of my childhood, Janesville, Wisconsin, and heading back there for a while a week and I haven't talked about this much and I'm going to keep it brief and mostly light um, but I think it's worth bringing up last year 2015 was a really challenging uh, year my family that I grew up with my mom and dad and I had uh, a sister younger sister we were a pretty tight-knit family as kids we did a lot of camping and fun activities, uh, a lot of good memories. Uh, we ran a family business for many years in my young adulthood and uh, just, you know, had a pretty solid family relationship. My mom passed away early in uh, 2003 and that was a, a blow to the family. 2015 saw both my dad and my younger sister uh, pass away. So that was a challenging, challenging time last year. And so I'm returning to Janesville for a week with my two boys to kind of help wrap up um, some family matters. And I'm pretty much going to leave it at that. Going back to Janesville is going to be, you know, exciting and tough because of all those memories. Um, it's kind of challenging and maybe a little selfish, I don't know. But being the only member of that family unit left is just, uh, it's really weird to me. So from, from a standpoint of, of just moving forward, uh, I've got a wonderful family. My wife, Lon, my six kids, and we've got a lot of adventures to do. And it's just kind of the cycle and the way life works. And there's a lot more to it, and I'm not going to get into it, but that is what we're doing next week. We're going to try to do some picking, and I will record most of that. I don't know what else we'll see. We're definitely going to be adventuring, um, taking super van. I would like to take the Jeep, but we need more space and storage. So we're taking super van. You never know what we might run into. So I wanted everybody just to know what's going on so it doesn't seem weird if there's not enough picking or uh, whatever going on. There will be daily vlogs. There'll be plenty of exciting things to share. So without further ado, thanks for watching and uh, on with the episode. Benjamin down to uh, basketball camp here on Friday. We got some major construction going on on our road today and yesterday and probably for a while. 
my favorite part is this pile driver thing they've got going. I don't know where the heck it went now, but it sounds like Godzilla is coming down the street. Boom, 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 boom. I don't know, they moved it somewhere. Do you see it anywhere? Nope. I like the pile driver. There's the pile driver. Just can't get the pile driver in action. Couldn't get the shot. Boom, 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 boom. Sitting in my office. Sounds like Godzilla or King Kong is coming. Boom, boom, boom. Got a concrete floor under the carpeting and so it feels like the whole place is shaking. Boom, boom, boom. You're supposed to be able to see him. He's huge. out here in, in the shop it's like a bass drum well from what I see here he's going to be going all the way down Which means we're going to have the whole shop taking like a bass drum for a while you can see concrete 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 all the way in Insanity, the madness. I can't take it anymore. Five, four, three, two, one. Lizzie. Oh, that's got her. Oh, oh. there she goes. <laughs> <laughs> you, like, pushed out that was fun. Lizzie, you like tackled him and pushed Give out Give me a fiver. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Five, four, three, two, one. Stay here, sister. Oh, nice one. down here 12 packages USPS today Okay, so the uh, contest in house for July is for an afternoon of karting at Unzer Racing for the family. We'll probably stay the weekend. Uh, if we can get $1,200 a day listed for each listing day in July. And so when we're out of the office, that doesn't apply. But we'll probably have 20 or so listing days. We've got six in the books as of today, Friday. 166 listings total, $9,261. Coming down to uh, earth a little bit on items, dollars per item and dollars per day. Most of the big stuff that we got from our 10 day Wisconsin picking trip has uh, been listed and so it's more bread and butter. And so $56 average per item, $1,544 per day. Doing well. We've got uh, today and tomorrow. Then we'll be out of the office for a while. And then we'll have to come back 
and finish up July to do some kart racing, indoor go-kart racing. Friday night, we got a couple minutes left on the pizza. We're gonna have a little pizza snack here winding up uh, Friday night. And let's see if we can see who's in here with us. Oh. Banana peeler. Hey, banana peeler, what are you doing? Watching the vlog. Oh. Vlog. Watching the vlog, listing some hats, getting ready to go on the road. Yep. Okay. Well, hey, uh, that is Friday in the books. I'm going to end the vlog here. Not super exciting day, but you know, not every day is super exciting. So that's just what we do. Uh, tomorrow, Saturday is going to be a lot of scrambling around, last minute things, get out of town. We'll find some exciting things to show and uh, then we'll get on the road and who knows what we will find, what we will see. Thanks for watching. Appreciate thumbs up. Appreciate your comments and support. If you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe. And this is vlog number 12 in the books. Thanks for watching.